What's up guys, how's it going? It's Robert Sislow. We are back here in the Maldives, the beautiful Maldives. And this is a video request from the wifey. She wanted me to talk about espresso versus Americano marketing tactics. So up until probably about two months ago, three months ago, before I started my heavy fitness and nutritional plan and dropped 31 pounds, um, I used to have Americanos, lattes. I put the milk in, the sugar, the honey, because I like the sweetness. I love the sweet. But then I realized that one of those things was preventing me from getting the six pack that I now have today. And it was very depressing. And so we're walking around here and I'm talking to the wife and I'm like, hey, what video should I do right now? And she said, why don't you talk about espresso versus Americano? I'm like, that doesn't make any sense. What are you talking about? So that's what we're gonna dive into right now. Espresso versus Americano marketing tactics so you can get an idea of what the hell we're actually talking about. So like, comment, subscribe, and share. Enjoy the view as we're down here in the Maldives, the Maldives, 9,000 miles away from Miami. Here we go. All right, good. So espresso, clean to the point, supercharged, right to it, a lot of power, a lot of boost, a lot of energy. That's what we're looking for, okay? Everything else, the sweets, the glitz, the, all that stuff, important, sweet, but does it, is it actually good for you? See, most guys would say, the fluffiness, they're gonna give you fluff, they're gonna give you information and things that eh, maybe you don't need. Or maybe you're tempted to do that because you see other influencers and guys doing this. Don't go to that route. Makes you fat. Makes you fat on stupidity. Makes you fat on dumb things you don't need. Body fat is annoying because it's unnecessary weight, okay? The guy told me, he's like, imagine carrying a 30 pound weight on your back all the time when I drop that weight, right? You gotta look at it from information. Marketing should be straight to the point like an espresso. Give you a shot, boom. Oh, God, I feel great. I could go climb a mountain. I could go surf for three hours. I got everything that I need because it feels good, right? So what, what am I talking about here? That's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about cut out the fat, cut out the sprinkles, cut out the extra foamy macchiato latte, get the espresso. It's tough to drink at first. Sometimes that simple truth is tough to take. Those sharp hit one-liners are tough to take, but I'll tell you what. Over time, you'll learn to love the espresso because I love the espresso. I love the espresso now, and that's how marketing should be. It should be espresso marketing coming to you live down here from the Maldives. Keep it simple. You don't need all that extra craziness. Look at this guy. Look at him. Hey, bro. Hello, my friend. Hello. You chilling? I used to have hermit crabs like this when I was a kid. That's all I'm talking about here. Espresso marketing. Clean like this beach in Miami. The beaches are crowded, okay? A lot of noise, people racing their Lamborghinis around. You come to the Maldives, it's peace, quiet, listening to the sound of the ocean. You hear it? Yeah. Espresso, it's what we need, it's essential. Your marketing should be essential. Only what is need. You ever see the movie Spaceballs? Have you seen Spaceballs? Do you know the part when Marv and Lone Star take the princess out and the princess is all kind of nasty and she's rude? And he goes, take only what you need to survive. Same thing in marketing. Say only what you need to survive. And then they're walking through the desert. They're carrying that big thing, right? And they're getting all upset. Marv and Lone Star are like, what's in this thing? They open it up. It is a massive hair dryer. And the girl goes, that is my industrial strength hair dryer. And I can't live without it. And what did the guys do? They left it in the desert because it's non-essential. Use the wind to dry your hair, ladies. I'm sorry, sometimes it's a necessity. Take only what you need to survive, drink only the espresso in marketing, and keep it simple. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you, wife. Thank you, wife. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching the video today. Listen, I got a couple things I wanna share with you. If you want help with promotion and marketing training on how to build a brand, transform your brand, you can go to cislowventures.com forward slash secrets revealed. It's a 200 course program online that gives you everything from starting with nothing all the way up to taking you to advertising. And whatever questions you might have, it's very simple, very short, very effective, gets you going. Number two, 
If you need any help with anything digital, video production, web design, graphic design, maybe you need printers, maybe you need flyers, maybe you need graphics, social media posting, Facebook ads, Google ads, YouTube ads, LinkedIn posting, Twitter posting, video production, consulting, training, any of those items, we can help you with that. You can just go to cislowventures.com, sign up there, go to the branding page, check out the webinar that I have, take a look at all that. And then lastly, if you're a high-end corporate client, one that's spending north of $60,000 a month in advertising spend, you can go to cislowspice.com and we have special corporate enterprise pricing for you just over there and everything digital, all right? So if you need anything, all the links are below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.